Give me money, give me money, give me money, give me money, give me money. Oh, hey, Carousel, I can see your house from here. And here we see the litter Duchess had with those other alley cats. How could anyone stay stubby eyed when it's raining cats and dogs outside? And the rain they just left that poor kitty out in the rain. They were giving them away. Why did they just leave them there? It's cold and wet, you assholes. <laughs> I always said this happened to me once, but instead of dogs, it was three guys trying to sell me a mixtape. Oh great, we found Sketchy as a dog, everybody. Our partnership is here with Dissolved. But wait! Wait, you're not being fair! Fair's for tourists, kid. This is what American culture is all about. Con artists letting children starve for their own personal gain. Sorry, did I say con artist? I meant con gris. God, this movie's so 90s. And it was made in the 80s. Oh my god, this movie is the reason the 90s were a hellhole. Man, New York City has really gone to the dogs. I mean, to be fair, it wasn't until the 2000s where the city was gentrified. And somehow, late 80s New York is still less of a nightmarish hellscape than 2019 Toronto. Oh, that's because there are no witches in New York. And all the holidays have like it. Hey, Frankie, man, what you watching, man? They're poor and they can afford cable? Fuck, baby boomers had it easy. This must be the pre-spectrum days. A greedy, ugly, psychotic Ooh. monster with razor-sharp claws. Dodger must have run into my ex. I, I followed this dog. He's lying, he's lying, he's lying, he's lying. He's lying. Shut up, Tito. Why would a cat follow a dog? To get to the hot dogs on his other side. Now, I lent you money, and I don't see it. Do you know what happens when I don't see my money, Fagin? People like you get hurt. Do I make myself clear? Yeah, that's pretty much the experience of student loan debt in America. I like cats. I like to eat them. Well, I mean, it's your own fault. You stuck your nose right at him. Uh, all right, time for bed. We've got a big day tomorrow. This is wholesome and soft, and I'm here for it. Investment banking, man. <laughs> Didn't you read about us in the Wall Street Journal? Really? Yes, captains of industry. Captains of industry? They're thieves. Oh, wait, that's basically capitalism. This is what I think of doing every time I see a rich looking car come down the street so I can get my tuition paid off. Your parents left me responsible for you. They won't mind, really. Don't worry, kitty. I'll take care of you. Aw, this is some prime honey crisp energy. <gasps> Girl, we've got to work to do. Oh, hey, this is me every time I wake up every morning. <laughs> This dog is the epitome of self-confidence. We should all be a little more like Georgette. Oh, you want to practice too. <laughs> wow, this whole movie is an origin story for Keyboard Cat. I love them. They're so soft. This movie is pure. This is such a mood when I talk to my dog, or, you know, anyone else that I'm close to. <coughs> hey man, if this is torture, chain me to the wall. Ah, oh, Tito's a mood. You're barking up the wrong tree. It's not you I'm after. It's not? It's not? Well, why not? Oh my god, you're here to kidnap me? Uh, no, I'm not. Why not? What's wrong with me? Huh? What 
What? What's going on here? Get going. Oliver got catnapped from his catnap. Here's something to remember me by, baby. She likes me, man. Ugh, men always interpret getting punched in the face as a symbol of love. <coughs> oh, shut up, you guys. We rescued you, kitty. I mean, we brought you home. But why? Well, I, I have another home now. And someone who loves me. I have another home now. Fuck you guys. What do you mean? You start with the knuckles. Ah, Fagin. Do come in. I'll be right with you. Is Sykes even rich? It looks like he's working out of an abandoned building. Is he a mob boss? Is he a terrorist leader? Is he a politician? Why did I say the same thing three times? Watch your jet. I can't read this. No, that, no, that's not right. It's left. Oh no, you babu watch your kitty back. And what kind of a person would steal a poor little kitty? He must have been a poor, desperate man. It's still wrong. Morals are a luxury only the rich can afford, ironically. Hey, hey, wait! What are you doing? No! Now the rich are eating each other! Ooh, wait, come back! Hey, see if we're going to kick. Wait! If he has a scooter, he shouldn't be complaining about having money troubles, said every Republican on Twitter ever. Pizza. It's New York, you have to order pizza. It's like the law or something. Hey, hi ho, hi ho, it's off to work we go. <laughs> Whoa, copyright infringement much? It's, it's Disney. You think Disney's lawyers are gonna let a little detail like that stop them? <laughs> Dude, come on, just roll down the window. Just because you're rich doesn't mean you have to act like it. Ooh, that dog is dead. Oh! This movie is the reason they put up the warning about train jumpers. Oliver! Aww, this is so soft. I believe that it's a <laughs> ten spot. Where is that checkbook? Oh, look at the time. Well, <laughs> we better be going. Indeed. Oh, come on. He saved your kid's life. Give him a break. With a little grooming. Grooming? Uh, <laughs> That's it. We'll start with a bath. Bath? And the minute any self-improvement is required, they're gone. It's just a new How does anything get done in New York with that kind of gridlock? You can't have 10 million people in one place like this. Wait, if you hate it so much... Why are you coming here next month? Miranda, you seriously underestimate just how much claustrophobic terror I'm willing to put up with just to hang out with you. Aww, Lily, that's gay. I'm gay! <laughs>